filmmakers of The Lord of the Rings comes a groundbreaking new saga. After the war, resources ran out. Cities were put on wheels. Earth became a hunting ground. We have to stop London before it destroys us. They're playing with fire. Do it! Mortal Engines. Mortal Engines was directed by Christian Rivers and stars Hugo Weaving as Sadius Valentine and some girl actress whose name I don't remember as Hester Shaw and this is based on a series of sci-fi dystopian young adult I don't know even it's young adult books again and this one's produced by Peter Jackson the director of The Hobbit and The Lord of the Rings series and that's basically the only reason I was interested in this because Peter Jackson's attached to it and this movie is just boring as fuck I mean when you start it you're like this could be good and by the end of the movie you're like this could have been this could have been good like yeah you can definitely see that the source material from which they're taking is an interesting one to say the least and if done properly maybe as a web series on Netflix or whatever could have been really great but this is like cramming basically like a big book into this movie it's like two hours top I think and this should have been like three hours long like the Lord of the Rings to fully appreciate the work of the author but I've never read the book so I can't compare but this does seem like it's something big like this and they just did this I mean all the actors are good like I said Hugo Weaving is in it like as the villain and it's Hugo Weaving He's charismatic, his presence on screen is like, yeah, keep acting because you're interesting when you're on screen because everything else is just generic main girl, female protagonist who is basically a Mary Sue and action CGI stuff, green screen, CGI landscapes. I mean, it looks grand. The CGI is not bad. It's done by Weta Digital, I think, Peter Jackson's company, but yeah, it looks good. It's big, it's grand, it's really, it has so much detail. And the world, like I said, it seems interesting. As if, take the Lord of the Rings and just like scrap all the stuff that they tell you at the beginning, which is important to know, and just go right into the movie without knowing nothing about the world. That's this movie. I had to go and read like a summary of the book to fully understand the movie. Get that. And the characters of fine the actors are good but the material they're given with it's just like for this movie it works but the fact that you don't know anything basically about their backstory except for like Hester Shaw the main character yeah it's just boring all throughout bland I mean visual effects are good the action is great there's just there's this g g big whatever machine with called Medusa whatever yeah, action's good, the CGI is good, the acting is okay, the actors are doing their best, but they it shows that they crammed this much book into this much movie, and this is again wasted potential for what could have possibly been a really epic franchise, but they blew it right off the bat. They should have at least made a three hour movie or made it into a series. I'm gonna give Mortal Engines a C you can watch it if you have nothing to do a Sunday afternoon or whatever but whatever as always guys thanks for watching give a big thumbs up comment below follow me on social media subscribe my channel that way I can see you next time